I've got a Sam's Club haul to share with you today. The total was, I believe, 430 ish but I will be popping up prices so you guys can see how it all adds up, what things cost on their own. So let me go ahead and take you down to my dining room table and share with you what we picked up from Sam's Club this time. And here's the spread. I did not put like things together as Mark and Bryce unloaded the car this time. As they brought things in, I kind of just spread them out on the table. So we are gonna get right into it. We'll start over here. I saw these and I thought Bryce might like to try them. They're the Honey Barbecue Boneless Chicken Bites. So he can just throw these in the air fryer and heat a few up for lunches. We needed some more bacon. Um, one, the kids, really like to have this for breakfast sometimes. And two, I needed some of this for a lunch that I'm prepping for Mark and I for the next week. So it's the Black Label Fully Cooked Original Bacon. You can eat it straight out of here. We do like to heat it up in the microwave. Something I think all the kids like, but Rose really likes teriyaki beef jerky. So I picked this up with her in mind. It's the Jack Lynx Meat Snacks. Again, teriyaki beef jerky. Picked up a bunch of bananas just for snacking on. And then I've got some non-fat plain Greek yogurt. This is a 40 ounce tub. I can't remember what I need this for. I think this is for the lunch. We're, we're doing a the same lunch that the bacon is for. Um, Elise Ellis's chicken bacon ranch salad, I believe is what it's called. That's what we're making for several lunches this week. So I'm pretty sure that's what that is for. Then we picked up a new Kinder. So this is not like on the meal plan for this week or anything, but I thought this lemon butter garlic would be good on seafood. So I picked that up just to stash away in the pantry for the next time we have seafood. A gallon of whole milk. This is for the kids, for cereal. Bryce likes to just drink cups of milk, so that is for them. I went ahead and picked up some more traits for Oliver. Um, he does have a few, but I think we'll run out sometime this week. So I picked this one up this time. It is Purina Prime Bones Chew Stick with Wild Venison. There's 16 in there, so that'll definitely last um, a week or two. I, he only gets one a day, so definitely over a week, but it is raw high free, limited ingredients, natural with added calcium, and it's a natural antler shaped dog chew. So pick that up for him. We are running low on paper plates, so we like the members mark of the paper plates. There's 204 in here. These definitely last a long while. All right, one breakfast. So this week for our meal plan, we are going into the first week of the shred. If you guys have been with me for a little bit, this will be the second shred that Mark and I are in um, with Nicole Burgess as our coach. And I'm taking it easy. I picked like two breakfasts, two lunches, and two dinners, and we're having those the entire week. So I could just meal prep it and be done with it because um, we're coming off of a reverse where we're used to eating more food. So I just wanted to make it easy peasy on myself. And one of the breakfasts that we're gonna be having is the blueberry cheesecake overnight oats. That's on Nicole's Instagram. So I picked up a bag of the organic frozen blueberries for that. And then as our dessert most nights this week, we're gonna be having some yogurt with nut butter. And so I saw this 18 pack and I thought it was great. That way we can mix up the flavor if we wanted to. Instead of, I did have to buy just one or two of these jugs or containers of yogurt, but this way we can mix it up. So this is the 18 pack of Oiko's triple zero little yogurts. There's six strawberries, six mixed berry, and six vanilla. And each little container has 15 grams of protein. So an easy way to get that last protein in at the end of the night. Um, one thing that Bryce asked for, I don't even know if he's ever asked for apples before. <laughs> so I, I typically like to ask the kids, every time I go to the store, what are you out of? What do you want? What do you need? And depending on what their answer is, cause you know, you know, kids, um, I'll, I'll pick up what they request. And so he asked for red apples. So I was like, Oh, okay. Um, so I picked up this four pound bag of envy apples for him. And then we've got some more produce here that is kind of our weekly or bi-weekly as we run out of it. We always have these three berries <laughs> in the refrigerator. So, and I try to get Driscoll's just because we're a huge fan of this brand. So we got the strawberries here. This is a 32 ounce container. Also got the 18 ounce package of blackberries. This is Rose's favorite. 
And then I, I really like the raspberries, but all the, all the kids like the berries. So we got the 12 ounce package of raspberries. Pearl's really been enjoying these mini cucumbers. She packs her lunch every now and then. She mainly eats at the school, um, but every now and then she'll pack her lunch and she loves these mini cucumbers. So I picked up a bag of these for her. Um, this was something else we saw and we just decided to grab to have in the pantry. I think we're having smash burger soon. So this will actually be really good on that. So this is a two pack of the Kinder's two awesome sauces. We've got the burger sauce and the fry sauce. So we figured we would pick these up and I like, they have other sauces there, but they are in like massive bottles. They are in like massive bottles. And just in case we don't like them, we haven't picked them up. They sound good. There's like a chicken sauce one and a, um brown sugar honey something i don't remember um but these ones are like the perfect size there's two 12.7 ounce bottles in here or like one of each of these sauces so i thought that was good um i picked up some ground beef just one pack you get three to a pack of the 93 percent lean seven percent fat seven percent fat ground beef um i I don't think we're gonna need this because I bought extra ground beef last week, but I think we'll be out and I'm just picking it up if I know we're gonna go through it just so we always have ground beef in the freezer. So I grabbed that and then coming all the way back here, I think I forgot this, um, but I am almost out of our Downy Unstoppables. I like to throw this in every load just to freshen the scent. So I picked up another container of that. We do need some more chicken. So I went ahead and picked up this 10 pound bag of the boneless ready to cook chicken breast. So that'll last us a little while. I feel like we go through ground beef a lot more than chicken, but did go ahead and get that. Um, broccoli, I picked up a few things just to have on hand, just in case um, I need to whip up something on the fly or something extra on the side. So I like to have broccoli in hand. I went ahead and grabbed this. It is a two pound bag of broccoli florets and I just throw that in the freezer and it goes great on a sheet pan. Just roast it in the oven and you are good to go. All right, one thing that Mark and I think we're having this with our lunches, a string cheese several days for lunch, um, and we needed the light specifically. So I got the 36 pack of the Members Mark Light String Cheese. I am completely out of minced garlic, and I do like the convenience of having this. So I picked up this big three pound container of minced garlic in water. Pizza rolls, all the kids love this. Super easy, especially on the weekend when there's extra kids over. We'll just throw this in the oven and bake it up and it is ready go to go for a quick, easy lunch for them. Um, I did pay convenience for this. So I could have cooked chicken and cut it up myself for our um, chicken bacon ranch, chicken salad or bacon, chicken bacon ranch salad, whatever. Whatever I'm making for lunch, it's Elise Ellis on her Instagram. Um, but I went ahead and bought this. It sounded good and it's already done. I just have to mix everything together. So this is the rotisserie seasoned chicken breast bites. It's fully cooked, you just heat and eat. It's unbreaded um, and it is a limited time offering. So I did go ahead and pick that up. I went ahead and got two 18 packs of eggs. We're gonna be having some eggs this week. We're completely out and um, Rose really likes to make eggs in the morning. Sometimes she'll even cook them for Bryce if he's still sleeping or if he's just waking up, she'll cook him some for breakfast in the morning. So stock back up on the eggs. This was something new and I immediately grabbed it and put it in the cart. I was gonna say, I thought about getting it. No, I, I saw it and I was like, yeah, that's going in the cart. So this reminded me of the Lunchables. So Rose loves the Nacho Lunchables and this is basically that, you just, get more and Bryce and Pearl might enjoy this too. Pearl could totally pack this in her lunch with the cucumbers and a fruit and maybe some, we have some of those like jerky or not jerky, um, the turkey sticks. So that would be an easy, quick lunch for her. Just little snacker Rooney type lunch. Um, but these are Tostitos chips and dip mix. It says 26 packs, but you can see it's not like 26 of everything. So you get 13 bags of chips and then you get six of the nacho cheese dips and seven of the chunky salsa. So I just thought that was something cool that maybe they could try out and see if they like that. Definitely a little cheaper than buying Lunchables all the time. For Miss Rose, I am almost out of my makeup remover wipes and I totally forgot to grab these the last time that they were on sale because I didn't need wipes, but now I'm almost out and they're not on sale. No big deal. Um, but I did go ahead and get, these, these are my favorite brand, the Neutrogena. This is a value pack for four day packs. Um, there's 25 in each and then one night pack. 
25 in that as well. Uh, the girls use these also. So I, there's four packs of these. I keep two and I give one to Rose and one to Pearl. And so I have two of these and one of those. And then when I'm out, I just buy another box. All right, um, the Jimmy Dean fully cooked turkey sausage patties, another item that Mark and I are gonna be having on our breakfast meal plan for several days this week. So I went ahead and got the 24 count. That way, that way we have more going into next week. So grab that. Um, this is, every time I go to Sam's Club, I pick one of these up. I almost picked up two of them, but I didn't. I just picked up one. Um, I really enjoy this cauliflower crust cheese pizza. It does not taste different at all. It tastes like a thin crust cheese pizza to me. And what I like to do is if I have extra bell peppers, I'll add bell peppers on it. I'll chop them up and add those on it. And I also really like to cook the Tyson um, blackened chicken strips and dice it up into little pieces and add that on it as well. And it is super delicious as a lunch option. So went ahead and grabbed a box of that. Um, I grabbed the Rayo's homemade marinara sauce is the two pack. Each of these jars is 22 ounces. Just to have on hand, we've got lots of spaghetti noodles. So I went ahead and grabbed that in case I want to whip up some spaghetti on the side of a dinner. Like if the kids aren't liking what we're having, that's just something super easy that they can have. Uh, we only have a few packages of these protein pancakes left and I really enjoy these. So I went ahead and picked up this box. There's 36, well, there's 36 pancakes in there. I don't think there's 36. There's three in a bag. So I don't know how many bags. I can't do quick math, math like that in my brain. I, I don't like math, but <laughs> premier protein, these are really good. Um, I have these for breakfast sometimes. And then I also, my favorite way to have these is for dessert at the end of the night and I'll do like a pancake taco. So I'll heat them up. It's a hundred, it's a minute and 20 seconds in the microwave for the three pack. And then I'll take like half a tablespoon of my American dream nut butter. The lemon cashew cheesecake is my favorite or lemon cheesecake cashew, whatever is my favorite. Um, and I'll put half a tablespoon on each one and I'll fold it up like a little taco, like a little pancake taco. And that's my dessert. Super delicious. All right. I grabbed the baked chips this time. Um, all the kids like the baked, so we went that way or that route this time. This is a 30 count. There's four of the cheddar and sour cream, four of the flaming Hot Cheetos, eight of the regular like cheese Cheetos, eight of the baked Lay's, and then six of the barbecue Lay's. Running low on toilet paper, so stock back up on that. Charmin is our favorite brand, so had to get that. Another thing I like to pick up when it's on sale, but I just didn't need them. Um, I guess when they were on sale or I wasn't paying attention and now they're not, but that's fine. Uh, I, and I do like to get the big pack just so I have plenty for all the females, but these are the always ultra thin and I love these. I feel like they work great. So pick that up. There's, I think there's two, yeah, there's 80 pads in here. So there's two big packages of 40 each. So grab that. And then last but not least, we are not. So this was like thinking ahead. We're not completely out of trash bags yet, um, but Mark noticed that these were on sale and will probably be out before or running real low before the next time we go to Sam's Club. So we went ahead and picked these up because they were on sale. The price that I'm popping up is the sale price. Um, but the members Mark Power Flex, tall kitchen bags, 13 gallon, you get 200. And we, we really like the members Mark brand. It, it works fantastic just as well as name brand. So we grabbed that. So that's everything that we picked up. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you are new. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Just like last week, I shared two grocery hauls. You're most likely gonna get two this week as well. I do need other things that Sands just doesn't offer, things that we don't need in bigger quantities. And I'm thinking about doing like a Walmart delivery. So I haven't decided yet, either Walmart or maybe tomorrow I'll go into the store and pick up everything else I need, but I'll share that. I'll go ahead and film it and share it with you guys because we do still need quite a few things. So with that, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.